The A to Z Guide to Bordeaux Wines. Today, the letter C as in classification. 1855, a year of great importance for Bordeaux wines. Hello, Benedict. Hello, Corinta. Can you give me the definition of a cru? A cru is the one of a property. It expresses the terroir. And to remind you, the terroir is the interaction between a soil type of a given place, its location and topography, and how this interacts with climate, grape varieties, and a wine grower's know-how. I also know that there are different classifications for the wines. The first classification for the border region was the classification of 1855. 1855. Why that year? Because in 1855, Napoleon III organized a universal exhibition in Paris. For this occasion, he requested that all the wine-producing regions of France should draw up a classification of their wines. In Bordeaux, the Chamber of Commerce and Industry was given this responsibility, which is subsequently entrusted to the wine brokers. And what appellations were concerned by this? It concerns the Medoc and Grave for red wines and Sauterne and Barsac for sweet white wines. On which criteria was this classification based? It was established by taking into consideration the price and the renown of the wines at that time. Has it changed since then? Almost never. Just one revisal in 1973 when Mouton Rothschild was promoted from second to first growth. What other wines are concerned by this classification? For red wine, it ranks 61 chateaux of the Medoc and Grave across five categories. First, second, third, fourth and fifth growth. And for sweet white wines? Sweet white wines of Sauterne and Barsac are ranked in three categories. Superior first growth, first growth and second growth. Here there are 27 classified growths. Universal Exhibition, Napoleon III, classified growths. Now you know as much about border wines as I do.